Americans, women and men, and it's something that all Americans should celebrate today. A big victory for craft store Hobby Lobby, the Supreme Court just ruling that businesses do not have to provide free birth control to employees due to religious re reasons. As former corner Sarah Belsol is learning, the landmark decision could have an effect on a similar lawsuit from a Southwest Florida University, and she joins us now with details. Sarah? Well, Emily, for more than two years, Ave Maria University has been fighting the federal government for an exemption to the Affordable Care Act mandate. Their first lawsuit was dismissed in March of last year, but the school filed another lawsuit in August. And now with today's Hobby Lobby decision, Ave Maria believes they finally have the momentum to move forward. It's a, a nice victory, but the battle's not over. Ave Maria University President Jim Tuohy is still in the fight. I think most Americans don't want to see the little sisters of the poor in Ave Maria University coerced into violating their sincerely held religious beliefs. That's what Tuohy says will happen if the federal government forces the university to provide free birth control to its 170 employees. Ave Maria University is a Catholic university and uh, we follow the teachings of the church. The university says it's thrilled that the Supreme Court ruled in favor of Hobby Lobby and hopes the decision has a positive effect on the school's own lawsuit. That lawsuit was filed in the Middle District of Florida last August, but a judge suspended action on it pending the outcome of the Hobby Lobby case. Uh, I think the court today made very clear that the federal government has the ability to provide free contraception without requiring the little sisters of the poor and Ave Maria University to do the work for them. But for Planned Parenthood of Southwest and Central Florida, that decision is very disappointing. It means that some bosses will be able to interfere with their employees' access to birth control. We really believe that the decision to use birth control, control should be between a woman and her doctor, not her boss. Planned Parenthood estimates birth control costs a woman about $600 per year and says that taking away that coverage will do more harm than good. Making birth control benefits available um, to all women reduces the rate of abortion nationwide. Ave Maria says it's now pressing ahead with its lawsuit. The school's safe harbor exemption ends on October 31st. So if no settlement is reached by then, the school says it will have to either decide on facing crippling penalties or violating its religious beliefs. Live in the studio, Sarah Bell, Soul Fox 4, in your corner. All right, thank you, Sarah.